Hello, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and today on Reliving, we're going to talk about the power of standing firm. One of my favorite books of the Bible is the book of Timothy. And in Timothy, in the second chapter, it talks about standing firm. Paul is saying to Timothy, Timothy, look, you're living in a world of shifting values. He says the world in which you live has strong inclinations towards evil. But you, as a Christian, must stand firm. Now, we're living in very similar days. In fact, it's amazing to me how quickly our values and our morals have seemed to have disintegrated right before our very eyes. Just a couple of days ago, in the province of Saskatchewan, for example, uh, public officials who solemnize marriage can no longer refuse on uh, certain religious ideas. That's amazing. 30 years ago, you would never have thought that that could possibly happen. But it is happening. You know, in 1982, for example, they brought in a new constitution into Canada. And in 2002, the leader of the government of Canada said that the values of Canada had so changed in 20 years that they were looking at changing the whole human rights code based upon the changing values. You say to yourself, how did it happen in such a quick time? Well... We live in a world of situational ethics. That simply means that whatever the situation is, there is the ethics. Now, I'm not here sermonizing on the how bad it is today, because I believe with all my heart that we can turn this around. But where does it start? It starts by choosing to stand firm, by standing on God's Word and saying, you know what, I believe God's Word. I know that the values of God's Word are not in vogue right now at this time. I know that one day, my standing firm is going to affect the world around me. In fact, I believe we can even affect the world around us today by standing firm on the Word of God. You know, the Bible says that the promises of God are yea and amen. That's what Paul said in Second Corinthians. He wanted to make us, he wanted to let us know that, you know, when we stand upon the, the Word of God, I tell you, our world can change. So, today... My encouragement for you is to stand upon the Word of God, to stand firm on your own beliefs. You will change your world. My name is Robert Dean Steele. This is Real Living, and we'll talk to you tomorrow.